Hi, my name is Nick Barton. I live on the Mornington Peninsula and I own a company called Crash Industries. At Crash Industries, instead of modifying a traditional jet ski, we started from scratch and created a unique design that we call the Foot Rocket. It's been specifically designed for flat water freestyle, but uh, I've been testing it in the surf to see if it does have some free ride applications. We use a process called resin infusion. This is where you dry stack a mould with all the composite, glass, carbon fibre, carbon Kevlar, etc. You then put the bag on and infuse the resin. This way of giving it a much lighter, stronger composite than, say, traditional hand-laid fiberglass parts. This particular foot rocket that I'm riding at the moment, which is a carbon Kevlar composite, weighs 116 kilos. Even with its heavy billet engine, it's still roughly 30 kilos lighter than a traditional ski. The key features of the foot rocket a 45 degree rail, adjustable tail plates, uh, enabling you to tune the length of your ski, bolt on sponsons for extra stability for the intermediate riders. There's an adjustable footwell system that we designed. One of the key features is being able to lock your foot right in so it has full closure over the foot, being able to move it backwards and forwards up and down the tray 15 inches and then also being able to adjust the height depending on the size of foot the rider has. The foot rocket's 200 millimetres shorter than most traditional hulls, but it's also a little bit wider, giving it more surface area and making it more buoyant and user friendly. Unlike traditional hulls with just ride plates, we decided to make a whole tail plate, enabling the rider to tune the length of his ski, being really, really short for flat water freestyle, so he can flip a lot easier, and then make it a little bit longer so it planes and makes it a little bit more rider friendly. The hulls come with adjustable engine beds, dual cooling lines, scuppers. We generally put a, a trim cable on there, which tilts the nozzle, throwing the nose in the air, which helps with your inverted trick. Every surface that our foot would touch, we cover in hydroturf, giving us more grip in the surf. We've also made a significantly larger engine bay to cater for all sorts of engines and drivetrains. My personal foot rocket runs a billet twin cylinder two stroke engine, which is 1100cc and has roughly 240 horsepower. All the graphics on all the Crash Industries hulls get done at Exotic Graphics, and as you can see on my Monster Energy Heart and Hainton foot rocket, they do a fantastic job. I hope I've been able to give you a little bit of insight on the foot rocket. If you have any further questions, hit me up on my website, which is crashindustries.com.